What is up everyone, Watering Grass here, and welcome to a pretty different video. Now, you guys obviously know from the title, this is a review of the first X and Y Phantom Forces booster box that we actually opened. Now, the reason why we're getting a review rather than the actual opening, which was two parts, two epic parts, because we did pull seven ultra rares from this box, um, is because I decided to accidentally delete the videos off of my camera before... <laughs> Oh jeez, before putting them on my computer for rendering and editing and uploading and all that fun stuff. So you know what? It's a little bit unfortunate. You can see we got two boxes back here though. This was actually the first box that we opened up. This is the second box and the second box was incredibly epic. You'll see that one coming up in future videos. Um, I have two more blister packs. I'm going to upload this video before any of them. I have uh, two uh, three pack blisters. One with the shift tree promo, one with the dark ride promo. And then, I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. And then we're going to go to the, we had 18 loose packs, which were epic. We're going to do three videos for that, six packs each. And then we'll move on to these Phantom Forces box, which we're doing four parts for with nine packs each. And the reason why I'm doing all that, you know, why I divided it rather than just opening up all 18 packs in one video or the Phantom Forces box in one video is because I want to make sure that I have content going out to you guys. I am going away in December for about a week, so I'm going to be not too uh, available, especially during that whole month, to be honest. But um, I am going to still try to put up videos, all that fun stuff. I'll do a channel update later uh, after I upload the boxes, all in other, well, this box at least, since we deleted that box. But um, oh, we are going to overview the first box anyway, so I can show you guys what I got. So um, we're going to start things off with the hollows. We got six hollows and seven ultra rares, so it was a really, really great box. And I'm kind of bummed out that we did delete it, but uh, if we can get this video up to 150 likes, I'd really appreciate it. Make me feel a little bit better. Uh, you know, I guys, you know, I appreciate you guys anyway. Your support means the world to me. So uh, yeah, so let's go through the hollows real quick. We start things off. We pulled a Gudra hollow, which looks very nice, very nice. A Pyroar hollow, another nice hollow. Now this, there's a funny story about this Pyroar. In the pack, and you guys aren't probably going to believe me, but <laughs> it actually happened. I'm not going to make it up. In the pack, we pulled 11 cards, and I believe there's only 10 cards per pack. Yeah, there's 10 cards per pack for uh, X and Y cards. Um, and we pulled 11. We pulled uh, an extra rare. So we pulled a Venonat Reverse, I believe, a Mighty and a Rare, and then this Pyro Hollow was the extra card in there. So pretty cool, pretty cool indeed. Not bad. Actually, the Mighty Yenna been might have been um, the extra because it was backwards and like... Uh, <laughs> behind the Pyroar Hollow, so I don't know. I wish I wish I could show you guys. But anyway, we got a Chandelure Hollow. Very, very nice Hollow. Curse Drop. I guess it likes that, you know, Pokemon likes that attack for uh, Chandelure. Then we pulled a Deancy Hollow, which I was super stoked about. Beautiful, 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 beautiful card. We also pulled a Deancy Reverse as well, so that was awesome. Then we pulled a Gigalith Hollow. Very awesome looking Hollow, sitting there in, a, what, what is that, Glittering Cave? Very nice. And my favorite Hollow that we pulled, obviously, was this beautiful beautiful Gorgais Hollow. So I was super stoked to pull that. I love this Gorgais card. It's a very good card and you guys know that uh, Gorgais is my favorite X and Y Pokemon. And then let's move on to the Ultra Rares. Now we did pull, go over here first. We start, we pulled both Team Flare cards. And in this box, I'm just gonna do a little bit of a spoiler for this box. We didn't pull any Team Flare cards. So these Team Flare cards aren't too easy to come by. Although we did pull very, very, very well probably better in this box than we did in the first box to be honest you guys can be the judge of that once i upload them but uh, we did pull a team flare head ringer so like i said we pulled both so we pulled the head ringer and let's focus on that real quick and the jamming net so very 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 nice very nice we also pulled a gengar ex and the funny story about this gengar ex uh back to back packs we felt that gloss at gloss and it was an Manectric EX, which I really want. I want a few more of. Uh, I definitely want to play set. I want to play set of Mega Manectric EX as well. And Manectric EX Full Art is a card I want the most from this set. I will trade for those cards. So we got Gengar and Manectric, two very, 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 very nice cards. Very good cards as well, both of them. Then we pulled some very, some pretty beautiful cards right here. We did pull two Full Arts. One of them was being this is a Rostic Full Art. Very, very nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, not a very good card, but still cool. Then we pulled another Malamar EX. If you guys haven't seen uh, the first packs that I've ever opened of Phantom Forces, the first pack that we ever had had a Malamar EX full art in there. Definitely go check out that video. It's pretty awesome. Got some other great stuff as well. So, But that was really cool. I like Malamar EX full art. Very, very nice. And then we got both Mega Evolution. So we pulled Gengar EX and Manectric EX. And then we pulled both Mega Gengar EX and Mega Manectric EX. 
So really, really awesome pulls. I really wish I was able to share them with you uh, through video, but you know, I guess this will have to suffice. You know, sometimes things happen. There's nothing you can really, really do about it. There's no sense in getting upset over it, but uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyway. Like I said, definitely stay tuned for the blister packs I have going up, including the Shift Tree blister and the Dark Ride Triple Pack blister. Then we'll have those 18 packs, six packs each. And then we'll, you know, we'll have this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Phantom Forces box that I am super stoked to get up. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this review of the first Phantom Forces box. It is an awesome, awesome set. Definitely go check out your stores, see if you get some. Order a box online if you got the extra cash. Definitely, definitely worth it. The pull rates are amazing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a big thumbs up. Stay tuned for all those videos that I said, including an update video. And I will see you all in the next video. Let's get a good look at Manectric EX and Gengar EX. Gengar. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. If we can get this video up to 150 big beautiful likes, I really, really appreciate that. And I'll see you all next time. Have a great night. Have a great day wherever you are in the world. This is Water and Grass, and I am out. Later. Peace. Check out the links below.